Hello everyone and welcome to Beat the Rush. Today we're cooking the most delicious vegetarian lasagna. Let's start by mixing 1 cup of soy mains, 2 cups of water, 2 tablespoons of soy sauce, and 1 tablespoon of vegetarian Worcestershire sauce. Let the siming soak for at least half an hour. Meanwhile, chop one onion, one carrot, and one celery stalk. To a pan, add two tablespoons of olive oil and the chopped vegetables. Mince two garlic cloves and add them to the pan. Saute over medium heat for 5 minutes until the vegetables soften. Add one third of a cup of wine to the pan and let it produce. Add one can of tomato puree and one can of water. Season with half a teaspoon of salt, a fourth of a teaspoon of pepper, two teaspoons of tomato paste and 10 grams of dark chocolate. Drain the siamese and add it to the pan. Cook over medium heat for 25 minutes or until the sauce thickens and the vegetables are tender. Meanwhile, melt 80 grams of butter in a saucepan over medium to low heat. Then, add 80 grams of flour and whisk until smooth. Let it cook for about a minute. Slowly incorporate 1 liter of milk, whisking constantly. Season with half a teaspoon of salt, a fourth of a teaspoon of pepper, and a fourth to half a teaspoon of nutmeg. I use half a teaspoon as I love it, but start with a pinch and then add more, according to your taste. Let the white sauce cook for about 5 minutes or until it starts to bubble. Eat the oven to 200 degrees. Spread half of the tomato soy sauce onto the bottom of a baking dish. Top with 4 lasagna noodles. I don't cook the noodles before assembling the lasagna. It's extra work and I think it isn't essential. Then, add one third of the white sauce. Repeat the layers of noodles, soy sauce, noodles and white sauce. Finish with 4 more noodles and the rest of the white sauce. Depending on the size of your dish, the layers may vary. Just make sure you end on the white sauce and then layer as convenient. Bake for 20 minutes and then top with 100 grams of mozzarella. Bake for another 10 minutes or until the cheese is golden brown and the noodles are soft when pierced with a fork. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video and subscribe for more delicious vegetarian recipes. Thank you for watching and see you next time!